Okay. Bubbling pretty good now. The pipe is hot. Hot to touch right to the water here. There's my little coil in the water. And what sort of temperature we got now? About 400. Okay. That's the oven temperature, not the temperature of the fire. Yes, bubbling rather well, and now I'm collecting it into a air bed. Then I'll pump it in with a pump I have into an LPG bottle, an old LPG bottle. Okay, here's a little um, portable stove, little cooker, and there's a bottle there. That's where I pumped the hydrogen that I collected last night. Pump it into there, and I'm got a regulator on it, so I'll just just crack it just a tiny little bit, and just hear it go on there. Just I'll actually turn the light off so you can see it. Beautiful blue flame. That's on really low. Hardly use any gas at all. Hang it up a touch. It's still extremely blue. And as big as I want it. Still blue as. Oh, there goes the smoke alarm. Excellent. All just from timber. The stove's on anyway, we have timber stoves on anyway, cooking bread or cooking something. And on the top there, I just heat up some timber and store the gas. For a day I don't feel like cranking the stove up, then I just have use this gas to cook with. Beautiful. Okay. Okay, here is a bottle of gas. That is uh, wood gas. It's a hydrogen and carbon dioxide. I've got it piped into underneath underneath the carburetor. I've got the uh, butterfly wired completely open. I have the fuel line clamped off. I've already um, run the motor and run it out of fuel. And let's do a quick test to see how well this runs. Okay, turn it on.
actually runs. Rightio.